Um, staging the riders was a big issue for us because we didn't have a huge budget to recreate um, everything that you've seen there, or, and, and especially everything that actually happened in Cochabamba. Cochabamba was closed down for 15 days uh, because of the riots, uh, and it was blockaded by the army and the police, and everyone in the city, a million people, were participating against this water contract. So what we decided was uh, we would be staging some of it, um, and we would be using newsreel uh, for another part. So everything you see, uh, when you see the crew looking at the TV, is real news footage, except when we see um, Daniel being arrested, uh, which we recreated, trying to emulate the look of the newsreel. And I think, actually, I'm very happy with this, because it, it, it looks very real. And then um, the rest of the staff is, uh, was uh, shot by us, although all the people there are extras working for the film. We try, I don't know if you noticed, but everything you see about the riots is told from the point of view of the people inside the car, which was a way uh, quite dramatic, but uh, efficient, to tell a lot without having to show too much. So, um, and that was the idea of Ethier together with the director of photography. Um, and it works very nicely. You seem to be caged inside the car and a lot of things going around you. Um, so that's, that's how, how we did it.